Annyeong! I am Andrew Collins, Jalopnik's chief test pilot, and this is the 2017 Kia Soul Turbo. Now, you're probably familiar with the Kia Soul. It's been with us since 2008. We buy 150,000 a year. But this year, we've got a new interesting elaboration, a 201 horsepower, 1.6 liter of four cylinder, and more interesting than that, a seven speed dual clutch automatic transmission. Now this is like Porsche style stuff, guys. It's very exciting for a little Korean economy car. And on top of that, we've got red striping on the outside. We've got stitching. We've got a G-shaped steering wheel, boost gauge, all the kind of frivolous crap we've come to love in the high performance small car segment. So we're gonna find out if uh, this thing's a secret hot hatch and what better place to do it than California's Canyon Roads. We are on one of my favorite scenic roads to take a little spin down. We're gonna take it easy. So let's start with the goods. The steering on this thing's pretty solid. The brakes, not super confidence inspiring. I mean, they're totally fine for regular use. If you're gonna squeeze it like I am, you might want to put some great pads on there, but like, look at that. Oh yeah. Yeah, we're just tracking right through this corner, man. It's a freaking Kia, come on. This car is way better than it has a right to be, even if it's not amazing. I love the cabin, I love how airy it is. I love the relatively high seating position. I've got great visibility, especially for a car this size. But I love the stitching, man. This is like something out of a European train, which is exactly the kind of stuff we see on like a GTI. Gives the car some good personality without being too in your face about it. So let's talk about my actual favorite feature. That's the gearbox. Seven speed dual clutch. Practically speaking, the benefit is faster shifting. Um, oh, there we go, there's a little tire screw, but still feels planted. The shifts are really quick, man. I think it, and I'm shifting up, down, up, yeah, man. And now I'm actually kind of enjoying myself out here. <laughs> it's like, yeah, man. <laughs> I mean, we're really pretty planted. I would say, put some good tires on this and uh, we might be in business. Here's what it comes down to with the Soul Turbo. You get sport mode. You get a torque meter. You get a boost gauge. Nothing that you can really do anything with, but it's fun. So the Soul Turbo might not be the Type R beating hot hatch that the uh, red stripe might have led us to believe, but you get a great gearbox, you get pretty solid steering, you get a really nice platform. For 20-something grand, what's not to like? <laughs> 